Mookie Betts coming there. What role is is he going to bat leadoff? Where is he going to be in the lineup there for you? Yeah, he'll hit at the top. And and Mookie, you know, we're still learning him and trying to get to know each other. But obviously, um, the track record, the baseball card speaks for itself. And I just think that that is really important. But I think that what he does for the Los Angeles Dodgers organization and, and the city itself, the fan base, that infusion of talent and, and character is big for us. And I think that a lot of people, we're all going to be gravitating towards him, and, and he's going to make us win a lot of baseball games. And, yeah, I see him in right field and at the top of the order. What about David Price's role in that rotation? David is going to be in the middle of the rotation, and um, he's a guy that uh, battled injury last year, and uh, he's a former Cy Young winner. He, he's a team guy, team first guy, and there's a lot of gratitude. There's a lot of compete. Um, I, we expect him to have a great year this, this year and kind of uh, help anchor this rotation. Can you have any more pressure on you, Dave, considering what's happened in the last couple of years, and now you add Mookie Betts to that lineup and David Price? No, I, I don't think that you can look at it as more pressure, Dan. You know, I think that if you look at a goal changing uh, or expectation expectations changing, I think that the, that's that would be the question. But for us, winning the World Series hasn't changed. So our rosters changed, but the goal remains the same. And um, we've added some really good players, and now it's just up to us to go out there and play good baseball, put ourselves in the position to do that and win 11 games in October. For more Dan Patrick Show, tune in to Audience Channel 239 on DirecTV, stream for free on BR Live, or download the Dan Patrick Show app.